Hi guys, welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the release preview channel, but for Windows 11 24H2. Well, in this video, we're talking about the build 26100.1586, as I've said, for version 24H2. In this video, I'm gonna show you what has changed, what is fixed, and what is added in this build. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, one thing that I have to mention is that Microsoft released a while ago Windows 11 24H2 on the release preview channel, and most likely next month, Windows 11 24H2 will be released as an optional update for the main release as well. And most likely next week, I'm gonna make a video in which I'll show you all the new features that we should expect in Windows 11 24H2 on the initial release. And also, I'm gonna mention features that are most likely coming later on. But talking about this build related to the new end task button, if we go to setting system and then for developers and you have this new end task enable end task and taskbar by right click button enabled as you can see here this option no longer shows a not responding dialog before it stops a task also Microsoft will soon enough start to roll out certain new features for the mouse and basically we're gonna have settings that will allow us to change the scrolling direction and also enable pointer precision basically some settings that are slowly being moved from the old control panel to the new settings app related to the file explorer Microsoft adds the ability to duplicate a tab whenever you right click on it. Also, Microsoft fixed a memory leak that occurs when you interact with our high folders. Also, an issue that causes File Explorer to stop responding when you browse within it was fixed. When you search from home for the first time, you might not get any results. Also, this was fixed. The address bar drop down menu might appear when you do not expect it. When you use the save dialog to save a file to gallery, an error occurs. Because of this update, your file saves to the picture library instead. This should be also fixed. The search box does not show the correct folder name when you are in gallery. Also, a blank area shows at the top of file explorer the back and forward mouse buttons do not work when you hover over the recommended file in the home section also images flash when you view them in the gallery so these are some issues that should be fixed in this latest build and also these things that I've mentioned are gradually rolling out so you might not see them right away on your computer also we have a normal rollout so you should encounter this on any computer a fix for the browser that ignores the value in the software Microsoft Internet Explorer and main registry key also a fix for the deadlock that occurs in the domain controller when it starts up in the DNS server. And also this update adds a prompt that asks you to confirm when you turn on open SSH using the server manager UI. So this is pretty much all there is to it to this latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for Windows 11 24H2. As I've said, pay attention to the channel because in a few days I'm going to release an in-depth video of all the new features for Windows 11 24H2. So stay tuned for that. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech page channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.